We come now to the second of the 17 principles which lead to the master key with which you may open the door to the attainment of your definite major purpose in life. This principle of success is called the master mind principle. I want you to understand the nature of the master mind principle because you must use it before you can take possession of the master key. An understandable definition of the master mind is this. It consists of two or more people who work in perfect harmony for the attainment of a definite purpose. Now, here are some interesting facts about the master mind which give you an idea of how important it is and how necessary that you embrace this principle, embrace this principle and make use of it in attaining success in your chosen occupation. And make use of it in attaining success in your chosen occupation. First of all, it is the principle through which you may borrow and use the education, the experience, the influence, and perhaps the capital of other people in carrying out your own plans in life. It is the principle through which you can accomplish in one year more than you could accomplish without it in a lifetime if you depended entirely upon your own efforts for success. And I have heard well-informed Bible students say that the first known application of the master mind was that which existed between the Nazarene and his 12 disciples. Of one fact, I am absolutely sure. When you form a true master mind alliance with others and work with them in a spirit of perfect harmony, and you can draw freely upon the spiritual forces within you and in carrying out your plans and desires. I also know that the master mind principle can give you absolute protection against failure. Provided always that your purpose is in using this principle is beneficial to all whom you influence.